My name is Susan Ryhall with uh, Nye County Animal Control. Um, I personally have had encounters with coyotes in my own backyard. I had five coyotes trying to attack my horse, killed all my chickens, and uh, three of the coyotes proceeded to try to take a chicken that I had in my arms. In other words, I had to fight these animals. They were not afraid of me. Um, and it was only when I hit one of them hard enough to where I heard it did they actually leave. This, uh, uh, just so the people know, you, you heard a noise, you didn't think you needed your gun. And when you went out, you found out that they, the coyotes were there and they were circling you at one point? Correct. Well, they weren't <laughs> until, you know, two of the coy coyotes, le they left. Yep. Um, I picked up the only chicken that was left alive and um, tried to get them to leave my horse alone. And when they left the horse, they turned their attention on me. And, and um, my dogs are, are pinned separately from my livestock. So the dogs were of no use um, mm. other than letting me know that something was wrong out there. I appreciate that. Thank you. I can't give you accurate numbers because we don't record these. When um, animal control receives about 5,000 calls a month, um, and this is strictly just a swag, but um, we generally receive about five, sometimes more calls um, a week over coyote issues. Um, the interface between the desert and the town is on, on a lot of different levels, so there is going to be a lot of interaction. Um, in years past, to, to date, I don't believe we have ever had anybody physically bitten by a coyote. However, that being said, um, it is not abnormal at all that small pets in particular um, are, are victimized by the coyotes. Um, either an attack, um, kill them and leave them, or more frequently, kill them and take them. That was called for the, uh, for the vote. Aye. Commissioner Brasky. Aye. Commissioner Wickman. Mr. Cox? Nay. Nay. Thank you.